Hola, muy buenas tardes, muy buenas noches, espero que estéis todos muy pero que muy bien, bienvenidos un día más a mi canal, vale, dejemos de hacer gilipollas y vayamos allá con otro canal más, otro capítulo más, quería decir, de Red Dead Redemption 2. A ver, ¿por dónde nos habíamos quedado? ¿Qué pasa, tío? We're moving on. Hay que seguir adelante. Pues sí, tienes muchísima suerte. Eh, examinar fotografía. No, no quiero examinar la fotografía, aunque no sé para qué ponen esa fotografía. ¿vale? Eh, lo de la medicina, ¿no? Que nunca lo hemos visto y estaba por aquí, se supone. Coger. Vale. Vale, ¿alguna cosa más? Ginebra. Bitter. Vale, ya está. Dejamos ahí. Para los demás también. Aquí, ¿qué es esto? ¿El juego este de la mano? Jugar al juego del cuchillo. Venga, vamos a darle. A ver quién va a ganar. You know, I think the last time I played this was with Skinny and those boys and Strawberry. Oh, they're just fingers, right? Te vas a cortar un dedo. Te le está metiendo velocidad, ¿eh? Toma. Bueno, metimos su parte. Vale, ya me toca, ¿no? Tres veces en 20 segundos lo ha hecho. W. Vale, vale, mal. W. Vale. Vale, vale. Vale, vale. Ya ha ganado. Arthur ha superado la vuelta y ha ganado esta ronda. Vale, perfecto. Eh... Bueno, omitimos lo suyo, si nos dejan, vale. Ha hecho cuatro, uff. Ha hecho cuatro. Mal, 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 mal. Venga. Vale, 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 es que era otro botón. Máxima concentración. Vale, cuatro, cuatro. Vale. Y entonces nadie gana. Omitimos. Vale, venga, ya. W, S, W. Vamos a ganar. Vamos a ganar, 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 vamos a ganar. Vamos a ganar, vamos a ganar. Vale, la estoy liando. Flipa, 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 A jugar por 20, venga. Vale, ha hecho 5, ha hecho 5, venga. W, ¿qué más? W, D, W. Vale, vale, la estoy liando, perdón, perdón. Vale. Ah, que, que espérate, que hay más letras. Vale, mal, mal, mal. Ronda de mega. Bueno, nos salimos ya, ¿no? Suficiente. Suficiente por hoy, ¿no? Vale. No se nos da bien este juego. Eh... Vamos a comer algo, ¿no? A ver si hay algo. Coger. Tenemos póker ahí también. Madre mía, cómo está la people. Con los vicios. Venga, comete todo de una y ya está. 
Perfecto. ¿Nos vamos a dormir un rato? Sí, yo creo que hay que recuperar energías. Arthur. Arthur. Luego. <ríe> Luego. Ahora no. Luego. Eh, venga, vamos a dormirnos hasta la mañana. Ocho horitas. Vamos a descansar nuestras ocho horitas. Y vamos a salir con energías hacia las siguientes misiones. Vale, perdón, es que estoy con el WhatsApp con él. El... Vale, esto es para irse de pesca. Vale, con Dutch teníamos cosas pendientes, perdón. Hi Dutch. Well, now, you sweating yet, Dutch? Of course, I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie whistling shithole. Uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. I'm not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Perdón, me metí un chocolate entre muela y muela. ¿Qué pasa aquí? A ver. Charles, I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. Girl. Charles. Coge tu caballito, por favor. Charles, sigue, sigue el ritmo. Next time we run an errand together, remind me to pack more bullets. Where are we going? Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney about these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are. Hold up a second. Come on, we gotta stick together. What was I talking about? Oh. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Arthur, you need to stay with me. Perdona, tienes que estar tú a mi lado. Pedazo de hostia que nos hemos metido. Pensaba que ibas a saltar sombra, eh. Vale, se recupera. Vale. Espera, te había manzanas, cigarrillos, ¿qué más había? Someone got here first. So it seems. By the looks of things, it wasn't a social call. Check the house. What do you think? This food's barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. Vale. A dónde se fue? Hay que averiguarlo. Bed's not made, so he must have been here recently. 
Bueno, y si no hace la cama, ¿qué? Bueno, y una nota, espérate. Big struggle. Pretty recently, I'd say. I guess right. maybe uh, 12 Come hours on. ago. But no body? Not yet. What are you doing? Let's go. Yep. Come on. ¿Pero qué haces huyendo de mí? Hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean for the bar fight, I swear he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew that's his special talent. See, he must have crossed over the tracks. Yeah, yeah. Huh. They seem to head. What are you doing? Vale, 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 la estoy liando. Perdonadme. <coughs> hey, look. Let's go see what those fellas have to say. Oh. ¿Qué haces? Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen them? <coughs> we're uh we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen a strange sort of feller? Sort of formal? Strange? Sure. Formal? Nah. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? You both better get out of here. Come in. Ostras. You are done now. Who's talking now? Trelawney. I don't know anything. Tell me where he is. You go to hell. You better tell me now, you son of a bitch. Okay. Okay, for Christ's sake. They took him to a cabin. Over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left. Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. To do it. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Come on, let's stay together. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, then. Yeah, pues dale caña, Charles. Whoa. Show me the way. Yeah. I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. 
I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he Look talked, out. I'll goddamn find out what he said. Hi, Charles. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. Easy! I mean, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. Vale, ya estábamos por llegar, ¿o qué? Bueno, viendo la mansión supongo que es ahí. Este es el maizal. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so uh, you're alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry, they won't be for much longer. Look, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. Ven de acá. Don't deal with them, my brother. Who knows what he told them? Let's get after those sons of bitches. Quick, find them. They're trying to hide in the fields. Come on, where are they? Where are you? I think I heard something this way. Where the hell are they? A ver, ¿dónde has visto ahí a quién? Es que no veo ni una pista de nada. Que no vi a dónde fueron. Vale, ya lo he visto.
Over here. He's dumped his gear. Look around. He can't have gone far. <sighs> Keep looking, Arthur. He must be close. Me estáis volviendo locos, ¿eh? Me estáis volviendo loco. No. ¿Qué me estás contando, de verdad? Me estoy volviendo loco. ¿Por qué señala la zona esta amarilla como que debe estar aquí? A ver. Vale, voy a ir uno por uno así. ¿Qué? ¿Qué? Take him and get out of here. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. Come on. He, he should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. Of course. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. The gunshots are coming from that barn. Come on. A tomar por saco. A tomar por saco, Paco. He should be the last of them. All right, let's go back for Trelawney. Hope that hat don't have lice. You all right? Yeah. Never goes easy, does it? Sure don't. Come on. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery feller. I wonder how much trouble he's brought with him. <laughs> Guess we'll soon find out. Seems like we can't catch a break now. Lux held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> sure. What's government agents and bounty hunters to us? Uh, I hope you're right. Vale, vamos a ver el de arriba porque me muestran una pipa aquí y la quiero, sí. Sí puede ser. Vale, aterrizamos aquí y luego aquí. Vamos, sombrita. So, 
Who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. Come down I'm here from Oregon. Looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep here. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles. You take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. There always seems to be more. More and more civilization. I want to get back in the open country of the West, or what's left of it, but well, even that ain't the way I remember it. Vale. ¿Para dónde tiramos ahora? Un segundito. Tenemos a este y tenemos a esos. Vamos a por John Marston. Y un momento, en esta ciudad hay más cosas. A ver. Vendedor de periódico, taberna. Persona desconocida. Claro que sí, hombre. Claro que sí. Vale. Provisiones. No. No me interesa provisiones. Tónicos, que son medicinas o algo así. Vale, algo similar. Eh, munición no, caza y pesca tampoco me interesa mucho. A ver qué puede tener caza y pesca. Va, no me interesa mucho. Productos equinos, ahí sí me puede interesar un poco. Para mi caballito. Pero no be cool. Estaba a 4, 4 dólares. Ah, vale, yo digo 400 dólares. Vale, y ya vamos a directamente a ropa. Vale, vamos a ver qué ropa encontramos y atuendos directamente. Atuendos. Vale, está 86. Eh, bueno, bueno, bueno. Vaya nivel, Maribel. El de 98 no me dejan, ¿no? Muy caro. Vale. Pues ya sabéis cuál voy a coger. Si no es el de 98, va a ser el de 92. Eh, perfecto. I'll let him know. You're paying next time, no. Vale, cerramos. Nos vestimos. Y comerciantes, pero a ver si puedo venderle algo. Eh, vender. Cebo para depredadores, aceite para armas, servicio de mantenimiento de armas. Judías, maíz. Judías no. Maíz dulce en lata no. Tener en lata no. Gomina. Los puros, puede ser. Café molido. Reino de caballo. Vale, y creo que podemos. A ver, comerciante, un segundito más. Ver catálogo y si vamos a comprar algo de comida. Provisiones. Fresca, alimentos secos, alimentos secos. 
panecillo. No, algo que de verdad nos dé energía. Sí. Sin existencias, sin existencias. Chicle de cocaína. Vale, vamos para atrás, para atrás. Vale, tónico para el Comida enlatada, vamos a ver qué tienen aquí. Algo que suba de verdad, judías pintas, piña en lata, salmón en lata, acercar, ok, manzana, maíz, melocotón, vale, la zanahoria sí es muy buena para el caballo. Vale. Esta no está mal. Vale. Ya está. Oye, tenemos dinero y todo, ¿eh? Vale. Hay que salir. Un segundito, que aquí me han dicho que puedo conocer a alguien. You won't. You okay? <laughs> Do I look okay? <laughs> no. You look awful. <clears throat> awful. Look at me. Useless. I wasn't born to this. I didn't deserve this. I used to be a gentleman. Jeremiah Compson. Compson Stead. Good for you. If that's anything to boast about. They took everything from me. Who did? They? And what did they take? My whole life. A whole way of living, a career. I stole a lot of things, but that's quite a lot to steal. Look at me here, living in the shit and in the mud. I'm sorry. <laughs> my old house. The house my grandfather built. All dilapidated and destroyed, <laughs> repossessed by the bank. I'm sorry to hear that. I was supposed to live a different life. Me too. If only I could get my old things back. Personal mementos, a watch, old pistol, my ledger. Where's this house again? Compson Stead. It's a north of... Scarlet Meadows. <laughs> Banks says I can't go near it. I'm living rough over by Harris Field. Well, if I'm ever out that way, I'll see what I can do. Time. Time is hell. Time is hell. Ok. Pues vamos a coger el caballito. Y ahora sí que tiramos para... Para John Marston. Aunque creo yo que no, no hacía falta poner el pico en el mapa, que no. Vale, ya está. Vamos para allá. Dale, dale, dale. Vale, no sabía que había personas. Ostras, estaba lleno de personas. A ver dónde está el otro, porque a lo mejor me tiro medio mapa. O más o menos. 
Josea, vamos a Josea. ¿Cómo aguanta mi caballito, eh? Vale, está disponible. Pues vamos a ir por ahí. Carnine de caballo. Los supposed to be my business partners here. He arranged a meeting, I believe, about some horses. A fellow with a scar and a Mexican. Yes, sir. Out by the stables. Thank you. Have a wonderful day now. Madre mía, pedazo de casa para poder cabalgar aquí. Problems with a family, a family of degenerates. Oh well, nobody likes degenerates. The hag and her inbred sons. They ruined this county. They killed my uncle, you know. That ain't right. Problem is, we can't be seen to get too close. And? We've got gold, Yankee. We've got gold. I ain't no Yankee, friend. I ain't nothing. My daddy came over on a boat from Scotland. I'm Scottish. In the Braithwaite's? Goddamn peasants. I don't know. Mongrels. Slave fuckers. All you gotta do is look at them. How much gold? Enough. These are prized horses I'm talking about. Them, they'll get you... Five thousand. Five thousand? For horses? Easy. And where do we sell them, these five thousand dollar horses? Over in Clemens Cove, fell over there, we'll run them out of state and give you 50 cents on the dollar. Mister, you got yourself a deal. Vale. Keep us away from this. Publicly, I mean. My sense is we keep all horse wrestling away from the public. Yo quiero conseguir un caballo de esos, eh? Go to the stables on the south side of the manor. That's where they keep the thorough. Bueno, bueno, bueno. Realmente es lo que yo quería. quería. Quería un caballo de ese nivel. Lo siento, Sombra, pero eres muy buen caballo, pero un caballo de esos. Yo quiero mi caballo para lo que reste del juego. Para pillarle cariño. Crazy old fool. You should see the Braithwaite woman. Osea and Sean were planning on going over to the Braithwaite. Haven't seen them? No, not yet. They're there already. They better keep their heads down. You don't need this to be any more complicated than it already is. Five thousand dollars for horses. We've been robbing the wrong folk all these years. Yeah. He doesn't know what he's talking about. But if we get even a third of that, it'll be worth it. Hey, so how are we gonna play this? Careful, there's a guard. 
I'll speak to him, okay? <sighs> All right, then. Can I help you, gentlemen? Yeah, we're here to see about some horses. Horses? Yeah, we had a, an appointment with Mr. Braithwaite, I believe. Yeah, I never heard about any of this. Our partner wanted to make a significant investment in some stables down here. But perhaps we should look elsewhere. Well, I... Okay, then. Let's head on up to the stables. Someone will come see you. Vale, venga, caballito. Lazo mansiones, eh. That's it. Nice and easy. No need to rush. Don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. Just up ahead. Heads down, play cool. We'll head around the front, hitch up there. All right, let's hitch up here. Whoa! Let me do the talking. Hello there. Can I help you, boys? I hope so. Heard you got some horses. We always got horses. Fine horses, I mean. I don't get you, friend. Yeah, you do. Come on. Listen, why don't you get out of here? You, Scarface, and your greaser buddy. Whoa! I don't like officials. We ain't officials. We're connoisseurs. Looking to do some breedings. Come on now, partner. Okay, fine. Follow me. These here's mainly the studs available for purchase or for working. That's what you're interested in? What is you boys interested in? We represent a famous uh, stable and stud farm from uh, Saratoga. Is that so? Unofficially. Of course. Well, this here's Cerberus. Here you go. Cerberus is a real reliable stud. Fathered many a rate. Vale, relájese, caballo. Sir, huh? Okay, bandanas on. Don't need nobody ready. Vale, pañuelos puestos. ¿Dónde está el pañuelo? Objetos. Ahí está. All right, I'll grab the white one in the middle. You get the other two. Relax, boy. Come on. Good boy. Easy, easy now. Whoa. Marston. Qué bonito es. Okay. I'll be here. Qué bonito, por favor. You're okay. Vale, vale. Yo he cogido más afecto con el mío, entendedme. I'll cover up the back if there's any problems. Regroup at Clemens Cove. Okay. What are you doing? Let's go, quick. Go, get out of here. I got the back. What the hell are you doing? Stop! Stop! You're being robbed! I said Vale, objetos. Vale, a ver, un objeto. Esto y energía, está bien. ¿Qué 
¿Que han matado a un amigo o qué? Sí, han matado a un amigo. Entonces, ¿qué tengo que hacer? Cargármelos. Bonitos, por favor. Vale, vale. Over here. I got it. Well done. Clemens Cove is just over there. Come on. Let's get this over with. Well, that could have gone smoother. That'll be on my gravestone. Come here. El marrón y el negro me encanta, eh. Look like they're paying 5000 for horses. I guess we'll see. Es que el marrón está precioso también. What you boys want? Heard you was, uh, heard you pay good prices for horses. Oh, we'll buy more or less anything, Pop. That's so? Sure, Pop. I'm Clay Davies. That's my brother Clive. We're twins. John, Arthur, Javier. So what are you, Cuban? No, I don't like Cubans. That's so? Maybe. Why, what do you care? You ain't Cuban. Maybe I like Cubans. <laughs> Ooh, you're funny. He's funny. Ain't he funny, Clive? Clive don't talk. We're twins, but I was born first. He came out all yellow and black, but he's okay. Ah. Sure. Yeah, I know these horses. They, they ain't yours, but I like you, and I'll give you, I can give you 654. Hey. <laughs> I was told we could get up to $5,000 for them. And I was told the moon was made of ladies' tears. Only it ain't true. Not one little bit. But... I like you boys, but I ain't got more than 700 on me. You want it, or you want to ride them fellers into town, and maybe someone there will hang you. We're gonna need more than that. 
I ain't got no more money, Pop. Here, take it or leave it. Uh-huh. All right. You goddamn fool, Marston. Ain't no one around here got $5,000, boys, but nice meeting you. <laughs> See you boys again, I hope. Come on. Yeah. Close the gate, Clyde. Believed a yarn spun us by one of that Gray family and imagined we was going to be wonderfully rich. <sighs> At the end of it, we felt like prize idiots. Pues sí, una miseria. A ver, un segundito. Tenemos aquí a... Josia, ok Pero antes de Josia y todo el rollo Vamos a ver Yo me quiero cambiar de ropa Necesito mi atuendo Ahí estamos Pero no, no es el atuendo que quiero Espérate, vamos a ver Tirantes, me gustan estos Vale, tirantes estos Y colores, tío Pantalones. Listen, uh, Dutch, <coughs> can I talk to you a minute? What is it? I think you vaqueros. Quiero estos. You. You know me better than that. Camisas. Do, Quiero la blanca. Save everybody. You know me. Vale. Chalecos. Este me gusta. Abrigos. Sin abrigo. Espera, sombrero. Sin sombrero. Abrigos, a ver qué tenía. Vale. Y lo del cuello. Espera, te botas también. Durones. Para cuello nada. Vale, ya está hecho todo. Vamos para acá. Y otra cosa, vamos a ver si nos ha aparecido ahí como para comprar caballos o algo. Perista. Vale, pues nada. Vamos a seguir haciendo misión. Arthur. Are you busy, Arthur? Why? Well, I know you think I'm just some effete buffoon. A what? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I've found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No, never. Well, who would have even thought? Of course I robbed a goddamn stagecoach. You know I have. And what's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head? Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know. But, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's he's going to give you all the decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot-blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. Vale. Vamos a montar en nuestro caballo y a ver a dónde nos lleva la suerte. So where do we find this friend of yours? Roads. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. You sure seem to have got about around here. You know me. I like to make friends in low places. How the hell you end up down here anyway? I could ask.
Vale, where are you? Here. Vale, venga, deja el caballo ahí. Come on. Hang back a bit and let me do the talking. We don't want to scare him off. Aquí ya he ido, ¿no? Sí, ya he venido aquí una vez. Hello, Alden. Hello, Josiah. How have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The witness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here... As a present for you. Vale, ¿de qué está hablando? There. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Martha. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south down the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, ask for my colleague there. Feller called Hector. He's also one of the... What did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it. Discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden. Or should I say... Adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. Mm, vale. What the hell was that? I thought you might like to see that pantomime. River Road through Silwalk. Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. Okay. This way. Vale, allá vamos. What did I tell you? Simple as can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry. Could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to Strawberry after all that market business. Didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble, you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. Hold up! Go! Here we are. This is the spot. Okay. This should do. Sure. Here. I'm hoping we won't need those. Well, better safe than sorry. What were you thinking? Well, according to this, the loot is located in a strong box, which is in the back. 
I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. <laughs> and I can do this silently? Well, I'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is Damson. Oh, very good, Alden, very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. There it is. Right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. I'll ride ahead and get the coach to stop. You hang back. Don't let them spot you or you'll scupper the whole thing. No, 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 no. It's a small benefit of the lock rocks. The black water. Did you see? Mrs. Chester Damson. I'm looking for him. No. Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. Easy. Easy, girl. Yeah. Nicely done, Arthur. A little finesse for one. Well done, sir. Well done. It was easy. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, it's 
It's always good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Vale, a ver cuánto dinero hemos sacado. ¿Qué? Ah, vale. Mi parte es menos, vale. Hemos sacado casi que con los caballos. Casi lo mismo que con los caballos. Vale. Venga, hay que correr un poco. Vale, ahora sí. That way. Espérate, hay que darle al caballo un poco de vida. for yourself if you don't got that money you owe Leopold Strauss. I, I don't... I, I, I need more time. Doesn't everybody. That casket for you? Or you want another? Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I can get it for you. But, uh... Well, uh... Come with me to the churchyard. And stay close. Hmm? All right. Oh, this ain't right. I, I mean, I I'll get you your money, but, uh... Oh, well, you'll see. What ain't right is borrowing money you can't pay back. I, I guess, I guess, I guess you you're correct, but, uh... This, it, it ain't exactly right, what we're doing. You ain't the first to put his hand in the collection box, and so you won't be the last. Rest a little easier knowing church has been taking more than they need off poor folks since time began. Well, like I say, well, the morality of the matter is a little more confusing than that. <sighs> okay. You head on in the church, I'll keep watch. Well, it ain't in there. It's under here. I'm digging up Mrs. Claypole. Jesus! Well, she got a bunch of jewels in there that she don't need. Oh my god. Oh, damn it. There's a bunch of people here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Look, you clear them off, and I'll wait right around here. But don't hurt nobody. We don't want no fuss. Don't be shy. You two might want to find somewhere a little more private. We was fine until you got here, mister. Good day now. Get out of here, kids. Move! Come on. I knew we shouldn't have been here. You missed your chance, boy! Ma'am, would you mind clearing out of here for some uh, maintenance work? Oh, gladly. It's about time this place got cleaned up. Okay, man. It's all clear. All right. Now go watch the gate. I'll get to this, uh, this exhumation. Vamos, madame. Vaya se.
شفتيهم؟ جاي I'm sorry, ma'am. The church grounds are closed for maintenance work. Well, it's about time too. The place was in need of some care and attention. Oh my god. Este juego es increíble, o sea, puedes desatender tus tareas y... yourselves a preacher you hear this fella i heard him all right we're gonna lick you bastard got some nerve on you que nombre que era broma Vale. Y aquí persona desconocida. Acá. You need me to move? Move? I am. I'm sitting in the wrong place. Excuse me? No, I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself a fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas. And they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? Mm, they didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. And that wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was some know-it-all big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of my fine words. The exact variety of my sins was the source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. Well, that ain't very nice. That was my impression. Still, compared to the gutting, castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me, I felt I got off lightly. Imaginative bunch. <laughs> yes. But no great love of my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. <sighs> Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. I'm sort of forced to. Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you looking for that fellow's wagon? I heard him say they was taking two Macombs in. Vale, quitamos el punto de destino y a ver. 
Okay, thanks. A ver, ¿está lejos o no? Está lejos, no, lo siguiente. Y yo queriendo ir a pie. Perdóneme usted. Iba con mucha prisa. Madre mía, si me han destrozado. Me han destrozado. A ver, tengo que tener pistola a mano. Espérate, nos acercamos. Diez centavos, en serio. Okay, come on, get you back to the doctor. Vale. Yep. So, uh... Marcha atrás, marcha. Just 
Vale. Count on seeing that wagon again. No, you for that matter. Only people you won't be seeing are the folks that took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Now, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Yeah, let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture? He'll be well for a day. Teaching to make one, he might be well a while longer. Well, I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. Perfecto. Vale, examinamos el documento. Leemos. Eh, usar. Leer. Vale. Leer. Guardar. Vale. Vale, un segundito. Información sobre diligencias. Armero. El caballo está por ahí. Y nosotros a la L o a la H. Vamos a ir a la H. I'm looking for Gavin. He's my best friend. He left me. I lost him. I mean... I lost it. Oh, I must have seen an Englishman. Yep, really funny it is. Vale, para la H, para Josea. Josea. This way, sir. A gentleman to see you, ma'am. So, your friend, the other liquor vendor. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Arthur, welcome. 
We were just playing cribbage. Arthur Morgan, Mrs. Catherine Braithwaite. Nice to see you again. Apparently. So this one, he is big and as dumb as he looks? <laughs> well, he's surely big, but his intelligence is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is as dumb as he looks, but I think, well, he's not quite that dumb. <laughs> so these are the boys going to Caliger Hall? Yes, we can take care of that for you, but one hates to be coarse. There is the question of money. <laughs> oh, we've got money, Mr. Matthews. Paper, bonds, metals. <laughs> she ain't gonna pay you in a certified check, you Yankee numbskull. Ain't childbirth just the most beautiful miracle on earth? Seems a lady can birth monkeys, after all. Hop on. I'll fill you in on the way. No, I'm driving. Fine. Ah! Man, sube, sube, sube. All right, let's get this over with. You was quiet in there. Took everything I had. That son of hers. I'll shove that silver spoon down his throat and pull it clean out of his ass. A smoke fucker. Okay. So what she got us doing at the Gray's place? Drive on the road for Christ's sake. She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. What? Yep. Using that back there. Moonshine? Born's faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fitting she did. All I'm thinking is how about I try fitting my boot up your hook. No, just snotty old bitch. Jose really picked the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Ah, he was giving his usual flannel. One of these families got gold stashed somewhere, he reckons. I mean, they are going to wreck the wagon. Come on, we're sticking it to rich folks. I hate rich folks. They really bear me some bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he, though? The master finagler of nothing. Easy. So far, we've destroyed the brake weight still. Whoa! Hold up a second. Are you not worried about them greys, English? Excuse me? You not worried about them greys? In what sense? Well, they know you. Yeah, maybe you're right. You know what? Here. I'll go hide and back. If you can act naturally and stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> yep. You want, boy? I've, uh, I've, there, there was a thing, a, a, a thing, at the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean, you know, harm. Uh, I, I've come from Donegal, in, in Ireland. You don't say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I, I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies. Uh, sort of business. Uh, uh, before the officials got there, okay. they said. Okay. Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink. Sean. <coughs> Amish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> uh, fine bit of country you've got here. Uh, not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Oh, is that right? And you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
Just over here. Yeah, it's straight down the path here. It's getting so I can barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, and they said they was looking for more drivers in town. I jumped at the chance. I never been a feller to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. A bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. Disgusting. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half. Just in there. Ah, right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> Quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there, uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy places they was, Hamish. Real fancy because if some folks got all the money they can build quite the fanciest places imaginable eh? mm. well the average man's how you getting on good nearly got these things ready okay guards out there. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. You head over to the dry barn. Sure. And you? I'm gonna deal with the fields themselves. We coat everything in moonshine, and then we light things up with these little fellas here. Thankfully, it ain't rained, and that old barn over there should go up like a torch. <laughs> how many of these boys you think you need? They should do it. Let's head out the back. Look, once they get wind of us, there'll be no turning back, so move quickly. Of course. I'm rebel stock, boy. I was bar burning down manor houses. Oh, burn quietly. Quiet. There's someone coming on the left. wagon already arrived this one didn't strange so what you got there tools payroll okay drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields sure see you later you hear that payroll yeah let's get this job done first okay just let me deal with our friend here Bu. Come on, you douse the fields, I'll meet you at the barn. Try to stay out of trouble.
Guess I've seen it all now. Hey, what the hell are you doing? No, no me digas que me ha visto, tío. Después del trabajo que he hecho. Madre mía. A esperar ahora. Strange. So, what you got there? Tools, payroll. Okay. Drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields. Sure. See you later. You hear that? Payroll. Yeah. Let's get this job done first, okay? Just let me deal with our friend here. Vale. Vale, lárguense, lárguense. Vale, nos esperamos, nos esperamos. Pues aquí nos esperamos hasta que se vaya ese señor, porque si no, no hay manera. No hay manera que se vaya ese hombre de ahí. Vale, están sonando pasos, se está yendo. Ese es, lárgate, lárgate. Vale. Esto sí ha sido paciencia por mi lado. Pero para no empezar todo de nuevo. Ahora me quedo con Sana Gran. Vale, vale, vale.
Give this a quick dose as well. Vale. Vale. ¿Qué ha pasado? ¿Qué ha pasado? ¿Qué ha pasado aquí? A ver, a ver. ¿Qué ha pasado? Has fallado. Sien ha muerto. Ostras. ¿Y este por qué ha muerto, idiota? Let's 
get the hell out of here fast. You right, follow me. That's a good girl. Money's worth, Arlie. Let's just get out of here first. I think we lost them. That we did. Quite a night. Sure. Interesting little fight Dutch has put us into the middle of here. I hope him and Jose are right and that there's some money at the end of it. Well, what now? Head on back to camp. You coming? Sure. Tobacco? <laughs> I'm busting for the smoke. Pues hasta aquí ha durado la misión de hoy. Vamos a ir dejando ya el vídeo por aquí. Tenemos a mi caballo para. Espérate, vamos a espantar a este. Vale. Y vamos a dormir. Vamos a dormir para descansar y recuperar fuerzas. Ah, y otra cosa, a ver cuánta tenemos dinero ahí de sobra. A lo mejor dejaremos algo en la caja también. Dormir. Eh, ocho horas. A ver si dormimos si la ropa se vuelve blanca. Vamos a ver eso. Quiero saber si eso pasa o no. Si no pasa, lo hace mucho más realista. ¿no? Madre mía, qué grande. Qué grande son. Vale, vale, entonces cambiar de ropa. Un segundito, vamos a guardar este atuendo. Atuendos. Guardar el atuendo. Vale. Vale, y otra cosa, cambiar de ropa. Un segundo. Atuendos. Pistolero. Vale. Ya me he cambiado de ropa, ropa nueva. Todo bonito, todo bien. Y yo que me alegro. Eh, libro de cuentas, saber quién ha depositado y quién no. Vale, Artu, ta, 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 ta. 5, 12, ala de murciélago, página 100. A ver, algo con efecto, alojamiento, munición, gallinero, herramientas. Vale, los caballos es algo importante. 
Unas granjas de un... Vale. Tenemos nuestras gallitas ahí. Vale. Perfecto. Sí, los que sí. ¿no? Vale, ya está, está aquí. Estoy guardando para mi caballo. Ahí, y ver un segundito, a ver si esto cuenta, ¿no? Estas mejoras cuentan. Arturo, por aquí. Tu parte. Libro de cuentas. Dar objeto. Alianza de oro. Donamos. Vale. Vale, más respeto, perfecto. Buenas, señores y señoras. Vamos a ver qué tenemos activo por ahí por el mapa. Tenemos con Lenny. Tenemos con Lenny, con GC. Y poquito más. Strawberry, Valentine, Rhodes y Black Butter. Vale, perfecto. Pues hasta aquí dejamos el vídeo del día de hoy. Así que un placer por seguir viéndome. Hasta luego.